feeling lost as to where you can create a first mover advantage this year? Before you choose, consider the key findings from Booz & Company's Global Innovation 1000 studies. Over the past seven years, Booz & Company has tracked and surveyed a thousand publicly traded global companies who invest the most in research and development. In 2012, they announced Apple, Google, and 3M were considered the top three innovators. Yet here is where the study gets really interesting. Their average R&D spending was $1.78 billion, which was much less than Microsoft's $8.7 billion. Microsoft ranked number five among the top innovators list. So Booz found that the most innovative firms outperformed the top 10 R&D spenders over a five-year period, and they outperformed in three areas, revenue growth, earnings as a percentage of revenue, and market cap growth. These innovators also share three things in common based on the study. One, they drive superior product performance. Two, they ensure superior product quality. And third, they have a really strong identification with their customers. So if you're responsible for driving top line growth in your organization, here's what these studies mean to you. Number one, the lines between marketing and innovation are becoming even more blurred. Customer engagement in the innovation process is no longer something that's nice to have. It's essential. Second, innovation is a state of mind. It is not a designated R&D budget line item. So if your culture fosters open-mindedness, transparency, and lifelong learning, then your probability of innovation success will definitely increase. Third, R&D investment increases do not guarantee growth. Innovation happens in the strangest of places. Consider increasing the percentage of time you're spending attending certain industry and customer conferences, for example. And last, turn to technology companies. In fact, turn to Silicon Valley technology companies for inspiration. The study revealed that six out of the 10 most innovative companies occupy that industry category. And I mean study these companies, visit their offices, interview their executives and thought leaders, and go to their customer conferences if you can. Consider how you can incorporate innovation into every growth initiative. I guarantee you the best ideas live outside the four walls of your office.